what we pull up on the National Weather Service. The weather.gov site. I mean, I did not say anything. I just said that I had talked to Melissa Morpus. I mean, I had sent an email to Melissa Morpus. And in fact, I had just sent an email about requesting a 30-day bus pass because a single ride is just not going to cut it with my travel needs. You know? Well, brother, that's between you and them. We can't solve all your problems. We're trying to be a place that helps as much as we can. But, well, I, I, I do know that, I do know that, I do know that, um, you know, I tried to get an appointment that I would have been perfect for, that it would have been good PR. They went and they found uh, someone that said, they found Cedric Alexander for it. All right, that's fine. I'm sort of new to town. But things like Escarosa, is Zandy Kareem starting a fight with me? Now, if I can get the southwest, if I can get the southeast Florida, that actually helps because going into the synagogue and saying that it was Zandy Kareem that blocked me from the unemployment office, that's not going to really hurt me when I go from synagogue to synagogue. It's not. But the thing is, is that, you know, I'm being treated unfairly just because I lack money, because I don't get a government check. And because I'm not suited for blue collar work, because I have a college degree. And, you know, the, the fact of the matter is, I did not say anything to her. I simply, I simply brought up the, pack, the fact about the bus pass. And I think part of this might be cultural, and I think part of this might be religious. You know, you Catholics, know, we learn how to. We're tired of hearing anything you have to say, anything, because you have, you have dug yourself a hole. If you want to be here and be quiet, I'm going to give you one chance to be here and be quiet. Yes, I will not say anything. I will not say anything on premises, and that, and I, I'll well, try not to say. We just to complain all the time about everything, brother. You know, we we can't solve all your problems. And I'm not so saying you can, but I'm going. I'm, and as I said, I'm not going to say anything on premises. I'm making that clear, and I don't say anything on premises. Okay. But y'all do not have the right to regulate my speech off premises. No, we're no, not trying to regulate your speech. We're, we're just asking anything. you, don't be, don't. Tell all your things, everybody going on. We, we so, 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 so what we're establishing is that as long as I keep it off premises, I can say whatever I want off premises, even if I'm say on Fairfield Drive. That's what we're establishing. Okay, you know what? Wait a minute. Let's get rid of this. No, this, no. no. If you go for a month, we're going to say you can come back in a month. How important, how we're just important going to work with you. You're just taking too here. much of our time, brother. No, so, so, I, so, I mean, the thing is, is that I was going to eat today. And I mean, I need I need a place to stay tonight. It's a bad weather night. It's going to rain. But you're making your choice by being just. I'm not making my choice. I apologize. I apologize. No, that's not going to work. We've been going through this with you over and over and over. And if you're taping it, that's fine because I'll say it because constantly it's one thing after another after another, and we just can't. We we don't want to. We don't want to spend our time dealing with things that we can't solve. I'm not trying to deal with anything I can't solve. I didn't do anything. We'll see hey, you we got in a month. Can you, can you we got a tour. So, uh, so, you, so I've been told that you don't get, ba that on bad weather nights, even if there's a ban, you've got a place to stay. Is that correct? That's why you want a ban, yeah. Yep. So I would have a place to stay his night. No, not if you're on a ban, no. You'd have, we'd have to refer you to another facility like that. Well, or you could try Richard's Memorial.